Lawman Bass Reeves chronicles the legendary figure's rise from enslavement to law enforcement. The new series premiere became the most streamed on Paramount Plus and has powerhouse performances by the cast, including Lauren E. Banks as Jenny Reeves. Take a look. You wonder why your children don't recognize you anymore? I have a duty. Swore an oath. Like the one you swore to me when we married. You may live out there beyond that deadline, but we live right here. You know I love you and them kids like nothing else. Telling us you love us ain't the same as showing us. Bill is waiting. How many pianos could you buy if I was still trying to farm? Buy me a whole orchestra and a church choir too, Bass. All that pretty music could mend the hearts you're breaking. Oh, and Lauren is with us now. Welcome. Good to see you. It's great to see you. And when you watch that, are you like, mm, good, not good. <laughs> I, I, I see it and, I, and I'm, I'm just thankful Jenny Reeves' story is being told. I know. You know what? Yeah. This is, so I mentioned it in the top, but this became the year's most watched series premiere for Paramount Plus, yeah. which is saying a lot, That's obviously, because awesome. a lot of people are watching that. The first two episodes have, what, seven and a half million views. That's what they say. How are you feeling now that it's out and everyone is Loving it. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm, I, it's a dream come true to just, you know, be an actor. I mean, yeah. Something I've been, you know, looking forward to since I was a kid. Um, and this is like my second big gig. So it's yeah. just like I mean, that's happening. And and then the world is taking it in. And it's 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 important to be able to tell stories that are universal and specific and yeah. to be yeah, validated by that number of people is awesome. Yeah, and what a great character to play too. You play Jenny and she's she's tough, she's strong, but she's also vulnerable, yeah. right? Like how do you see her and how do you want other people to view her? Um, I see that woman. I, I've seen that woman all my life. You yeah. Know? Like in my mothers and my aunts and my grandmothers. Um, Did I you want pull to, from them. Oh, for sure. Yeah. I think it's a, a lineage and a legacy of womanhood that yeah. I think is specific in African American culture with le, with uh, Jenny, but universal uh, across the globe. And um, and I want people to just appreciate. I probably you know she's soft. And she's also strong and powerful and all these things, but she's she's a dreamer. Like there's a yeah. there's a lot in her that she wants to share with the world and, and, and a hard time to be, to be a dreamer. Of. Yeah. Too. In in order to have that she needs fertile soil to grow and, and be who she is. And yeah. that's what this show has provided me. Yeah, yeah, so absolutely. <laughs> um, and then uh, this is based on a true story and there's a lot of uh, research out there for yeah. other characters. Yeah, yeah, not a ton of stuff written about Jenny. So, no. was there research for you? Like, how did you yeah. um, explore her? My research came. I saw two images of Jenny. One by herself. One with Bass. They were tintypes. Yeah. And I saw census records. You know, just kind of get a sense of who she was related to, what their names yeah. were. But a lot of it came from my context clues about Reconstruction, about being a newly emancipated person in the world and about um, trying to figure out exactly what to define what freedom meant. They had to decide what that meant yeah, for them. Yeah. And I think that took a, a great amount of courage and, um, and a moral compass and, and also, you know, a lot of, of vigor. Yeah. But um, the, the research was it was extreme, especially because she was a woman who gave birth to ten children. I've never given God birth to her. any. Uh, you know yeah. what I mean? Like I can start. I've there. had three, and that's tens a lot. <laughs> it's wild. And then doing it in, in that time, you know, on the yes. kitchen floor or something uh, like that. I, can't um, even. I spent a lot of time endowing my fake prosthetic belly yeah. with the same kind of relationship that I, I imagine a mother has. And yeah. then I would go out into Fort Worth, into town, and you know, just experience what it. That nobody what knew. What it was like. Yeah, otherwise. Well, I gotta mention this. Um, so I, I heard that Oprah threw you a party she did. for the show. And what is that me, like? But <laughs> what's it like? I mean, take us inside that celebration. What's it like when Oprah throws a party for you and your cast? I, uh, so she, yeah, she knew <laughs> her David that we weren't able to attend our because premiere. Of strike, because right? of the strike, right? Because of the strike. And she said, okay, you know, David, we'll, we'll, I'll throw this party for you guys because you really deserve, the show is so good, I love it so much, ah. and I really want you and the cast to have the full experience of celebrating with each other, yeah. and we danced so hard. But outside, I was really cool and calm and collected on the red carpet. <laughs> and then yeah. I got next to Oprah and, and David, and it was just like the inner kid in me just <laughs> came out. Oh immediately. my God! Yeah. yeah. Um, and, it's, you know, she's an awesome champion for art and, and, yeah. and our culture, so I'm very happy. Yeah. yeah. And, and that's some, now your BFFs. All right, you can watch <laughs> Lawman Bass Reeves out now on Paramount Plus with new episodes every Sunday. Thanks so much. Good to see you. Nice to see you. Thank you for having me.